I haven't used this for a while. Let's go ahead and... Boom! Yeah, I forgot about vats. Work well done. Nice. <laughs> What's up, Internet? Bow to the Dow, back again with episode 73 of Fallout New Vegas. And this is the finale of Honest Hearts. It's been a great DLC. I enjoyed the river. I enjoyed the characters. And most of all, I enjoyed the upgrades. But alas, it's time to head back to the Mojave. But first, there's going to have to be a little more bloodshed. Let's play! All right, we are ready to wrap this DLC up, potentially. Now, here's the plan. Here's the plan. I am going to try and find this last survivalist cache that I missed, so I'm probably going to like fast travel around to the caves. It seems like all of them that I found were in caves. And we are going to take a look... And see if we can find it. Not going to show you guys this whole thing of me just fast traveling and looking around and talking to the computers that I've already done. Um, but I will bring you back when I find the last one. We can share the experience together. And then after that, we're going to move on, come back up, talk to Daniel and say that we want to fight. We're going to fight. And I'm pretty sure that brings us down here so that we can do whatever we got to do. And I think we're and I think it's done. I think it's done. So that's the plan. I'm going to fast travel and I will see you guys on the other side. Oh, no way. Is that it? Oh, <gasps> yes, we did it, guys. Oh my gosh, I went around to so many caves. I was kind of hoping for another terminal to look in, but no terminal, I guess. But we found the last... Huh? Oh my... But we found it, guys. I went around to like all these caves. Start over here, and I went to like this one and this one, and I didn't do those right away. I went to this one. I knew that I just got this one. Eventually, I was like, well, shoot, where else could it be? So I just started checking these ones. Then finally, like the last cave, way back here from the beginning, found it. Let's go. All right, time to continue on with the story. Let's see what we're getting up to next. Gotta talk to Daniel. Unless you and Joshua have any objections, I'd like to start evacuating the sorrows. I'm going to need your help, so say your piece. Nah, we gotta we gotta get rid of these guys. No. Why? Why? Haven't you seen enough of what's going on here to see that the sorrows don't need to butcher the white legs for a piece of land? What Joshua wants is more than an attack. He wants a slaughter. And he needs more than you and the dead horses to do it. The sorrows can't be pushed into this. You and Joshua don't have the right to force them into it. Please, consider what I'm saying. Okay, but they are like, they're terrorizing all these people. Clearly, it's not a thing for peace. Yeah, it's like a dog-eat-dog, killer-be-killed world out here, especially in the apocalypse. No. This is how we made the world. And we brought it to them. Joshua must be waiting for you. I'll stay here with the others. Uh, fine. That's fine. I don't need nobody. Anyway. Thank you for this. 
I know Daniel doesn't approve, but destroying the White Legs is the only way to ensure the Sorrows can remain in Zion. I mean, that's part of what you I'm saying. The Sorrows might want to stay. Sorrows hunters into three Marys from this position. Our objective is to find the White Legs leader, salt upon wounds, and prevent him from fleeing. Show no quarter to the White Legs we come across. Make no mistake about why we are here. This is an extermination. Let's Got get it. With you. All right, so we have to run all the way over there to get him. I suppose it would probably be best to come up onto land. Eh. Alright, Joshua, daytime. Let's let's keep it moving. Oh hey. Ow. I don't know why I didn't switch to my shotgun right there, but whatever. Oh, we definitely want to take all these cases and such. Is the thin red pace like actually healing me? Am I reading it right? Do I only get f 15 HP from this blood sausage and it takes 20 seconds to do it? Because I kind of was under the impression at first that it was 15 HP per second for 20 seconds, which would be way too good, clearly. So it's got to be, oh man, maybe this isn't very good. Whoops. Yeah, 7 HP. That's not going to get me nowhere. Come on, man. Is that a guy too? Yep. See ya. Take it. You call down the rat. Dang, Joshua's killing dudes. He's doing way better than me. There it is. Get my gun out. I am terrible. Okay, we're closing in, Joshua. Just you and me here to wipe out 
a whole slew of dudes. Gah. Come on, man. That's it. Don't you set me on fire, brother. Get out of here. Let's go. Man, Joshua is the strongest companion we've had yet. And he doesn't complain all the time, <laughs> which is great. Okay, through the red gate and into the three Marys. Maris, whatever it's supposed to be. Where's the, uh... Where's the spot? Oh. It's way over there. Whoops. Well, this DLC's been really fun, honestly. I was really upset that there wasn't like Enough. there wasn't a merchant anywhere for me to sell my stuff and play the game normally but it was cool it was fun I'm excited to try the next ones I think we're looking at the uh oh, where am I being shot from there you are <laughs> Oh, I'm almost out of bullets. Oh no. That's gonna be an issue. But I've been really happy with uh, what it looks like. The story, or the characters were interesting. The story really wasn't much of anything. It was just like, hey, go fetch this, go fetch that. We're trying to leave, but we need these things. I haven't used this for a while. Let's go ahead and... <laughs> Boom! Yeah, I forgot about vats. Work well done. Nice. <laughs> Pretty sure this machine gun was kind of just better than the other one. But I wanted to use the other one anyways. Oops. There. That guy all the way up. Yeah, 351. Oh no, the DPS here is higher. Okay. But this one only weighs less than half as much. But I, I just, I like the feel of this one better. Okay. Then we have to turn and go down this way. It's funny that it's just the two of us and we don't have, like, the whole clan coming in to help out. That seems a little wild. Come on, Joshua. Let's get him. But yeah, I'm really stoked to get back to the wasteland and find some familiar places that I can go, like, sell my stuff, make some bull. I could have made bullets in here, but buy bullets for, because I'm not going to be able to make, like, that many bullets.
Oh, a Sorrows Tribal. Hey. How's it going? A toaster and an empty box. Sick. Oh no, we got slot. We got destroyed already. Why were they here before us? Oh man, you guys should have let us take the lead. I don't think I've ever seen a box like this one locked before. But we will take all the XP. We want to keep getting levels. Get all them stats up there. My stats are starting to look pretty good, man. So we got, we got what? We got most of our things to 80. The ones that are important, at least. Oh, I also can't wait to get back so that I can get... I only have strength. Oh, no. More strength would have been a great idea. Yeah, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80. We're working on survival and barter. Medicine can kind of sneak its way up there, I guess. We're looking really good. I suppose we are beginning to close in on the end of this game. Take it. This is where the road ends. What's happening? I think they just blocked that off. All right, you can't stop me. We're going to get there. Man, I am in desperate need of bullets. Why is my guy gone? Where is my friend? Where's my guy? What? Joshua? Uh, well, all right then, we'll just keep going. Let's maybe make use of that level 100 sneak, huh? That's in it. Storm Drummer, that's cool class.
feel like my dude was not supposed to leave me. Joshua, I need you. Please help. Hello? Anybody else? Wait, wait, wait. This way. Yes. Sit down, brother. <laughs> Closing in. I can do it all myself if I need to. Oh, I got more more friends. Hey guys. What's up? Yeah. We're the leaders around here. You guys don't have to stand for this no more. Got on our bad side, now we're gonna wipe you out. Disciple of Canaan. Okay, I'm feeling a little bit of lagging happening. I'm gonna pop a save real quick. So we have something at least. Yes, keep giving me ammo and cases because I'm going to need to make so many bullets when we're done. Oops. I don't see anybody to shoot. Explosives, they're finally working. We needed 80 points. We don't have any of the perks that like make it good yet. 
but we're getting there. We're getting there. That one's a Sorrows. I think that one's a bad guy, isn't it? Just waiting for me to get closer for it to trigger. I don't have the strength to steady the weapon. Interesting. Oh, I thought I was gonna lose my mind right there. All right, what are we working with? That's Sorrows. They have them cowering. Oh, now they're fighting. Okay. Let's check the bodies for loot. Nothing. Nothing. <laughs> Get out of here. Stab. Stop us, please. <laughs> Get out of my life. Oh my gosh. That's the AoE kind of thing that we needed right there for sure. That was glorious. And we're chilling on bullets for it too. Very good. Very good. Definitely hurt myself though. you at Syracuse and you persisted you took advantage of us at New Canaan to drive us out and like the dogs of Caesar you are you followed us to Zion yeah and now you stand on holy ground a temple to God's glory on earth the only use for an animal in our temple is sacrifice Kale watch conserva o I mean he's a little bit of a religious zealot. Don't you? But these are Caesar's Outman. legion people. Kunaman mad. He kill all white legs. You talk. You stop. Nah, uh, I don't think so. You can no nikumpa me. They are you. Forward. You can nikumpa me. It's the same yeah, man who brother. Had died on his knees. But I suppose this was for the sake of the dead horses and so Whoa, 3000 XP. Thanks to your help and the grace of God, the 
white legs won't be troubling Zion anymore. I got like a level and a half Let's right go there. Find Daniel. Tomorrow will be here soon enough. And there is much to do. Oh baby. Oh baby. Fifteen skill points. Um yeah, we just keep raising all these not level eighty ones. Ah, let's put five more points in explosives. Yeah. Because we have melee weapons and unarmed still, like, pretty much untouched. We don't care about that. Energy weapons, like, there's some cool ones, but I'll, we'll just wait till everything else is done to take care of that. Barter. Survival need points, medicine needs points, and explosives is a combat skill it wants to be at a hundred. Very cool. Oh baby. And so it was that the conflict between the new Canaanites and the White Legs was finally resolved. Maddie girl, the we did it. Involvement had to we escape, did it, Bubba. Shifting the Yay. fragile balance of power. Despite their defeat at Three Marys and the death of their war chief. The White Legs were determined to pursue the other new Canaanites. But when they finally tracked down their prey in Colorado, they discovered the tables had been turned. The White Legs who survived the new Canaanites' ambushes were hunted down by dead horses before they could reach the safety of the Great Salt Lake. Um, when word of the White well. Legs' diminished numbers reached the 80s tribe, war was declared, and by year's end, the white legs had been wiped out. The sorrows fought Maybe that wasn't like the best choice. And the dead horses, eradicating the threat the white legs posed to Zion. When the courier and Joshua Graham felled salt upon wounds, their victory was celebrated with a great feast. The sorrows transformation from a peaceful, timid tribe into a proud and warlike people broke Daniel's heart. He tried to take solace in the knowledge that they would remain. I didn't really want to turn him into a warlike tribe. I just felt like the sorrow's innocence was lost. Sometimes you can't just let Having things go. To eradicate the white legs from Zion, the dead horses returned to Dead Horse Point in triumph. They remained neutral toward the sorrows, but as years went on, there were periods of competitive friction, even violence between the tribes. The new Canaanites. Daniel especially, intervened regularly as mediators, but found it difficult to reconcile the tribe's conflicts. Oh no. The defeat of the White Legs and Zion marked a turning point in the fortunes of the Happy Trails Caravan Company. Every two months, the caravan met with the new Canaanites in Zion Valley to trade. Happy Trails soon returned to prosperity. The vigilance of the sorrows and dead horses in defending southwestern Utah initially startling. Well, how did they get through? Aren't, aren't we stuck here? The, blessing. the tribes united against the 80s, driving them back from Highway 50, and thus opening yet another trading route for Happy Trails caravans. Though the courier had stopped Joshua Graham from executing salt upon wounds, the war chief still fell in battle. The White Legs defeated at Three Marys. Joshua led the sorrows and dead horses in tending to their comrades and burning the corpses of their foes. He continued to advocate militant opposition to the enemies of New Canaan and showed little quarter to those he fought. And yet he was changed. He no longer reveled in the brutality and cruelty for which he had been known in his former life. His inner demons, if not extinguished, or at the least, appeased. For years after the well, I'm of the White glad Lens, that Joshua is Daniel not so much of an emo boy now. To the sorrows, spiritual needs. Try as he might, he could not hold back the tribe's increasing militancy and reverence of Joshua Graham. See, they're demoralized. He, he tried to, to family, bring religion to family. them. His <sighs> haunted him for the That's rest a of rough his subject. Days. And with that. The courier walked out of the history of the tribes of Zion and back to the gathering storm of the Mojave Wasteland. Oh!
Joshua Graham's armor. Yes, I can carry all of it. Let's go. Nice. Medicine and barter plus five. That's interesting. Crit chance plus three. That is also interesting. Oh my. Oh, it's like all the way broken. I should probably repair that. Yes, it's light armor too. We don't need this anymore. Oh my gosh, we finally found it. Sweet looking armor. Crit chance plus two, sneak plus five. It's pretty good too. <laughs> All right, well, they don't exactly match, but we look way better. We look way better. Look at us. Look at us. And now all of a sudden I can't turn the camera back to the front. That's... There we go. Yeah, I feel like the mask... It'd be pretty cool if, if I could get Joshua Graham, like, helmet, like, the bandages. That would have been sweet. But let's go. Now we don't look dumb. We got upgrades on our armor. We found some upgrades on our weapons. Overall, this DLC has been a grand success. A grand success. And then, you know what? I even had put some stuff in here, too. Yep, and I can come get these things back. Oh my gosh. We are exiting into a new era of the the warlord of the waste this is awesome welcome back to the mojave desert ah oh! of course it's nighttime but oh let me see this map again oh it's been so long i'm back i'm back guys i'm back we did it! Oh, there's still so much to do, so much to see, so much for taking the back streets. Yeah. You'll never know if you don't go. Okay, okay, okay. So there are still several other things to do. But I, I feel like probably what we're looking at is maybe maybe taking up a couple more spots on the map, do a quest or two in here, not the main quest, and then move on to the next DLC. So I suppose I'm going to have to put up a poll about which DLC I should do next. Oh, those are all... We have... These ones, Sierra Madre, grand opening. I don't know what that one is. There's three more DLCs, Is I think is what I'm seeing. Oh man, all right, that's, that's awesome. That was fun, that DLC was good. Should have done it earlier, probably, everybody was right. I guess we'll uh, we'll hang out in the Mojave for a little bit and then swiftly head off to the next DLC. I'll see what you guys are interested in doing for the next one. So thank you so much for watching. I will catch you in the next one. But until then, don't forget to have fun. Peace.